A passenger airliner is about to land at least Ferenc International Airport. A common sight from the control tower, which by now has become a symbol of the airport. The controllers working here are in charge of the safe takeoff, landing, and coordinated movement of almost 90,000 aircraft annually. This is what a landing aircraft will look like from Hungara Control's new aerodrome control center, the remote tower. To the controller's naked eyes, the aircraft would not be very clearly visible, but here they will get a much more detailed image of the traffic moving on the runways and the aprons of the airport. Remote uh, technology is a 21st century uh, innovation and is uh, challenging the actual borders of air traffic control. Especially in Hungary, we don't want to replicate or duplicate the actual tower vision, uh, which the ATCOs can see. Uh, our approach is uh, that we would like to provide much better visual information for them and would like to take them closer to the traffic uh, which really interested in. The so-called distributed camera system can provide uh, more detailed information uh, from the uh, airport layout and even in a bad weather condition because they can see much closer than they can uh, do this in the, in the actual tower building. We would like to integrate a visual presentation to ASMGCS screen, aiming to enhance the situational awareness and the safety level of air traffic management service. The remote tower is able to provide much more visual information with much more detail, and the handling of traffic can become considerably safer than it is today. A so-called distributed camera system, consisting of several camera locations, will be installed at the two runways and junctions of List Ferenc International Airport. The system will be capable of producing a suitable image, even in extreme weather, and visibility will be improved even in complete darkness with the help of the night vision cameras. The center of the control room will be the huge segmented video wall which will display both runways and the entire apron and will also show radar data and flight information derived from the ground surveillance system. Screens showing the image of the individually controllable zoom cameras installed in the workstations and a synthetic radar image will also support the work of the controllers. Obviously, we have to get used to the new ways of working that we cannot look out of the tower anymore. We see the runways and the taxiways through a network of surveillance cameras which provide additional information thanks to advanced technology. Although it's a great challenge, it is also exciting to take part in the development of the remote tower. The controller working positions and the video wall are designed and produced according to our needs and ideas. Hungara Control will be the first in the world to introduce remote tower control at an airport with medium traffic volume. With the help of this technology, controlling the traffic of the airport will be possible not only directly from the airport, but even from a remote center, opening new horizons in the future of aerodrome control.